Hello, welcome to Fun Pets and Kids. This is my dog. She is a Lab Sharpe mix. Female. She weighs about 52 pounds. She's just over a year old. She loves to go out for walks and runs. She loves to play. She does love to chase her toys around. She eats, that's her food, in water bowl. It's raised up off the ground so she doesn't have to strain her neck as much in order to reach her food and water. If they're too low to the ground, they could have trouble swallowing their food and get a little choked up. She eats about three cups of food a day, one and a half in the morning, one and a half at night, as to not make her overweight, being that she is spayed. This here is our other dog. He is a Dachshund. He weighs approximately 11 to 12 pounds. That's his house. We give him his food in this here. In a smaller container. He eats a half a cup of food a day. Uh, right now he's getting a little bit extra because we're showing you what he eats. Nothing more than a half a cup. And we do keep his food separate from the other dog's food otherwise you know we could have a little fighting issue and one eating more than they're supposed to he is a long haired so we make sure we shave him down we get his hair cut at least once a month because if they get too hot their skin will dry out and they become very itchy we also make sure we get him a oatmeal bath He is approximately five years old and an awesome dog. And as you see here, we do have stairs for him so that he can get up onto the couch on his own free will. This way it reduces how much he has to jump because they do have joint problems and we don't want him to dislocate a disc in his back, otherwise he won't be able to walk anymore. This is our lab's bed. She also has a kennel that is the size of that mat, which we put away because it is very big. But she doesn't sleep in it anyway. She chooses to sleep under my bed or on it, depending how she feels that day. But mostly under my bed. We don't understand how she fits under there. And that's our cat. He is approximately four years old. And there is all three of them. And they are all rescue pets. He came from my husband's job. He came from somebody that I knew that was getting rid of him to a shelter and we decided to take him in. And thirdly, we got her from a shelter as well. Now in here, this is our bathroom. We are in our bathroom right now. We keep our cat's food up on the counter in our bathroom. Otherwise the dogs will try to get in here and eat it and we don't want that because the cat food can make them sick. And we only fill the bottom there. And as you see, it has to be all whole pieces and different colors. Otherwise, he will not eat it. We also have a bell on the door with an eye hook. Which we keep like so. And this keeps our larger dog out of the bathroom and away from the litter box as well as the cat food. 